Coach, I have this theory that Monday football, the quickest way to build a program is to implement the spread, be explosive with the spread, hold serve on defense until you can recruit some really good defensive players. And I think what Mike Watson is doing at Maryland is an example of how being explosive on offense can really help you build a program. So let's, Jerry, let's take a look at Maryland's offense. And it's a combination. They're getting very good productive play out of a freshman quarterback, Tongo Bailoa, the transfer from Alabama. <laughs> Incredible talent. Uh, great with his feet, but he also throws the ball really well. So you can see they're starting to get a little bit of a feeling for their system. This is called three-level passing. And three-level passing is a way to flood zone coverage. And that's exactly what Maryland is doing here. So when I talk about three-level, you're going to see someone knock off the top of the coverage. That's the first level. Right. The second level is going to be the intermediate throw. That's usually 18 to 20 yards deep. And then there's going to be someone underneath, and that's usually someone three to five yards deep in the flat. So you have someone short, someone medium, and someone deep. You know, it's not very complicated. It's very easy to teach, especially with a young quarterback, and they execute at a high level right here. So it's a rollout pass, well protected. Get a shorter quarterback out of the pocket. And you can see Tungo by Loa does a great job of, he reads a deep defender. So who's a deep defender on this particular play? Safety. You'd think yeah. it'd be the safety. The safety bites here on the second level. So the deep defender is his first read. Deep defender bites, so he's going to throw the ball deep. I've heard you talk about if you move your quarterback, especially a quarterback that's shorter, the disadvantage is the defense only has to defend half the field. That's right. So if you're only going to defend half the field, it would make sense that you would flood it. Is that's that right. When you break the field down in small areas, he can get his eyes in that vision. It's very simple. How do you read this thing out? Deep defender, flat defender, deliver the ball. One, two, three. There's always a movement key, which is deep defender, flat defender, and then a progression. What's a progression? I imagine it's going to be X, Z, H, because X is the deep one, Z is the second one, H is the guy in the flat. So, so high to low. So it's high to low, and there's always a progression in three-level passing. Well, let's take a look at this play on the board. We've seen it on the video. Let's take the audience to the board. This is three-level passing. This is a very simple scheme. And what makes it so simple is it's only a half-field read. That when we break this play down, you're going to find out he's only focused on really one half of the field. Number two is it's a very easy read for the quarterback. It's a deep defender to flat defender read. We'll go through that in a minute. And then finally, there's a real clean progression right in the quarterback's vision. It's X to Z to H. So let's go ahead and install a three-level uh, pass. The first one, the outside receiver, is going to clear it out. And when I say three-level, there's a deep right. receiver, there's an intermediate receiver, and there's a short receiver. The intermediate receiver, or corner route, is going to come from the number two receiver. This is the X, this is the Z, this is the H as he comes in motion. H comes across in motion, and he's going to go to the flat. So the quarterback's rule is deep defender. You're going to find the deep defender and throw away from him. In this particular look, it's going to be the safety. As you can see from the videotape, the safety starts to level off. He doesn't get depth at all, right. so that tells the quarterback to take the shot down the field. Very simple for the quarterback, very good for a young athletic quarterback, not real big. They break the pocket, they roll out, they get him out of the trees so you can see, and it's in half field read, the progression, one, two to three, right in front of them. So what's Maryland do well? They're taking advantage of very good athletes. They're taking advantage of an explosive quarterback with his legs, and they're also giving them simplistic schemes to execute at a high level. And they're helping the offensive line a little bit by yeah. getting the quarterback on the move. Yeah, I think they're doing a great job. This quarterback is not going away for a while. I love watching him play. He's a freshman. Loxley obviously knows him very well from his Alabama days and his brother. Good bloodlines in that family, too.